too many tamales. Snow drifted through the street, and now that it was dusk, Christmas tree glitter in the windows. Maria moved her nose off the glass and came back to the counter. She was acting all grown up now, helping her mama make tamales. Their hands were sticky with masa. That's very good, her mama said. Maria happily kneaded the masa. She felt all grown up wearing her mama's apron. Her mama had even let her wear lipstick and perfume. If only I could wear mama's anillo, she thought to herself. Anillo means ring. Maria's mama had placed her diamond anillo on the kitchen counter. Maria loved that anillo. She loved how it sparkled, like the Christmas tree lights. When her mother left the kitchen to answer the telephone, Maria couldn't help herself. She wiped her hands onto the apron and looked back at the door. I will, I will wear the ring for just one minute, she said to herself. It's okay for just one minute, right? The ring, el anillo, sparkled on her thumb. Look how happy she looks. Maria returned to kneading the masa, her hands pumping up and down. Her mama returned and took the bowl from her and told her, Go get your papa for this part, she said. Then the three of them began to spread masa onto the corn husk. Maria's father helped by plopping a spoonful of meat in the center and folding the husk. He then placed them in the large pot of the stove. They made 24 tamales, 24 tamales. La familia came over, tíos y tías, abuelitos, abuelitas, primas y primos. Prima uh, Dolores, prima Teresa y primo Danny. Maria kissed everyone and said hola. Then she grabbed Dolores by the hand and took her upstairs to play with the other primos. Tugging, tagging along after them. Vamos, primos, vamos. They cut out pictures from the newspaper pictures of toys they were hoping they were wrapped and sitting underneath the Christmas tree. As Maria was snipping out a picture of the pearl necklace, uh oh, she remembered something. <gasps> El anillo! Everybody stared at her. What a neo, the Lord asked. Without answering, Maria ran to the kitchen. Oh no, do you know where she left the neo? Oh, oh, take a look. The steamy tamales lay piled on the platter. El anillo is inside one of these tamales, she thought to herself. It must have come off when I was kneading the masa. Oh no. She asked her Primos for help. Ayuda! They looked at her, each other. Danny asked, What do you want us to do? Eat them. She said, If you buy something hard, tell me. Oh no, so they're about to eat 24 tamales, 24 tamales. Can you eat that much? The four of them started eating. They ripped off the husk and bit into, the, into them. The first one was good, the second one was pretty good, but the, by the third one, the tamal, ooh, they were tired of the taste. Keep eating! Their stomachs started to hurt, but only one tamal remained on the plate. This must be it! This must be it! The ring must be in this one! First, Danny took a bite. Nothing. Then Dolores took a bite, nothing. Then Teresa took a bite, nothing. Still nothing. It was Maria's turn. She took a deep breath and slowly and gently bit into the last mouthful of the mal. Do you think she found it? Nothing! Didn't any of you buy something hard, Maria asked? Danny frowned. I think I swallowed something hard, he said. Swallowed it? Maria 
idea, cried her eyes big with worry. She looked inside his mouth. Teresa said, I didn't buy anything hard, but I feel sick. And Danny said, look at my tummy. It's getting so big. Now, Maria knew what she had to go do. She had to go and talk to mom. Mamá, tía, tíos, papá, abuelito y abuelita, they were sitting in the couch and they were talking to each other. They chattered so loudly that Maria didn't know how to interrupt. But finally, she tucked on her mother's sleeve. Mamá, she said. What's the matter, mija? Her mom asked. She took Maria's hand. I did something wrong, Maria said. What? Maria thought about the beautiful Ania that was now sitting inside Danny's belly and got ready to confess. Then she gasped. El Ania was on her mother's finger. Bright as ever. El Ania, Maria said. Oh, Mom said, was this what you were looking for? Do you see El Anillo? I wanted to wear it, Maria said, looking down at the rock. Then she told them all about how they ate, they have eaten the tamales. Mama y tías looked at each other and said, well, I guess it's another we have to cook another batch of tamales. So toda la familia, tíos y tías, primos y primas, abuelito y abuelitas, fueron a la cocina and they started making tamales. Y estaban cantando, Feliz Navidad, ta tan tara tam. Feliz Navidad, para, para, pam. Feliz Navidad. Prospero año y felicidad. Para, 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 para. And that's the end. Amigos, feliz Navidad. Adiós. No coma mucho tamales.